Okay, so today I'm going to show you how to set up Friendly AI. Okay, now I've actually had some uh, subscribers recently. Uh, they're having a, having a bit of an issue with this, so I figured I'd make a video about it and show you guys how to do this. All right, Let's spawn in single demon encounter. Now what you need to do set assign team. You go to this tab, set the team one, because that's what your character is set to. We start this up. There you go. Set a little icon above his head. That's how you know he's on your team. And you can see he will not attack you. In fact, I'll change the character real quick so that way you can I get a ranged character on him so you can see a better example. Go here, let's do an imp. Come on, come on, load up. And there you go. You can also shoot them and they won't die. <clears throat> Now if you do, let's see, this, it should do the same thing. Now, if you're having any trouble with that whatsoever and they're still attacking you, go to include spawn, hit yes, and they still will not attack you. In fact, I'll make a second one too while I'm at it, just to show it off. That guy. Assign team. Spawn. Oh, wait, I gotta set the. Uh... There we go. And when they spawn in, not only will they not attack you, but they won't attack each other either. Because they're on the same team. And there you go. Real simple. Now, the reason why they included the last option here was because um, <clears throat> back when the game first came out, um, if you said the team won, they would still attack you and each other for some reason. Uh, and they fixed that with later updates, so it doesn't do that no more. But if you're still having an issue with that, just turn include spawn on and it should fix the problem uh, no matter what. Another thing you can do on spawn, you can do a team proxy. And immediately sets it to team one. And you can do the same for both. And get rid of these. It should still work. Now again, you set it to team one, they'll be your friends. Okay? 
unless you set your main character to a different team, they're always going to be on your side. If you set your character to Team 2, or Team 3, or Team 4, uh, they're going to start attacking you. And there you go. So that's how you get that to work. Show off one more example. I'm going to set one to team one and the other to team two just to show you that it does work. Just so you know that you know, if you want to set two different teams against each other, this will work. <coughs> fighting each other. And the bad guy lost. So <clears throat> and that's how you get that to work. So if you want to make, you know, some battles or if you want to have a bunch of guys on your side and maybe just go in some boss or something like that, you can do that now. So that being said, thank you all for watching and hope you all found this helpful.